Barbara here, and I'm with... Say friends! Say friends! Hey. Hey. Hope you all had a very Merry Christmas, a very happy everything. I don't think Kwanzaa happened yet, but okay. uh, anyway, we're still in the holiday season. Yeah. Coming up to the new year. Mm -hmm. Do you, do you, do you, <laughs> Does anyone have <laughs> any New Year's resolutions? Please share them in the comments below. Ooh, I haven't thought about that yet. Oh. Except the standard ones that everybody always has. Get organized, lose weight, mm -hmm. be smarter. <laughs> <laughs> I always try to go to um, at least like one social engagement because I am a hermit and like to stay home. Yeah. So <laughs> <laughs> One a year or? <laughs> oh, no, at least one a month um, yeah. is usually my goal. So good, yeah. I, I had that a few years ago and I, I stayed to it and I was really <laughs> proud of myself, um, but I didn't have it last year and okay. I didn't what go happens? anywhere. <laughs> yes, nothing <laughs> happened. So speaking of homes, our nichelings have been here for a while and they're spreading yeah. out. Nine days. Nine days. So what did we decide? I think we're going to have everybody kind of half and half exploring mm -hmm. uh, and we will eventually go to this island. Yes, I think that is what we had right. agreed upon. Let's just jump in these little guys here. <laughs> Forgot the bunny was still there. <laughs> hanging out with Beluga over here. That's cute. Okay. So we are keeping a close eye on Zenith's age and Sunflower's mm -hmm. age. Hoping that they correspond just in time for her to have a baby with it's him. It's going to be a close call, yeah. It is. Um, we'll get other people caught up. We've got the um, Derp Snout kind of rumping, ran, running rampant. Yeah. Here's hoping we meet a handsome stranger or beautiful stranger. All right. We're doing well on food and everything. Whoa. What was that noise? I don't know. It's not like a nicheling. Maybe it was them growing up. Oh. Aw, Belle's all grown up. Aw. And Zenith, I think, has one more day. Oof. Cutting it close. <laughs> um, Shard got a little older. And so did Rosie Coral. Okay. So. A lot of pink in this uh, family now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, pinks and like whites and stuff. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's look around, but I don't see anybody. Ooh, there's a mole, though. So let's take care of this side first with Tonky. And white dot. All right. So, okay, that's right. Wonky is piano's mate. Mm -hmm. All right. So they'll be in charge of going this way and seeing if they can find something. I don't know if it's worth going all the way down here. Maybe one could travel out that way. Yeah. So let's do one berry and a couple steps. Uh oh. She's separated from the family. Mm -hmm. Um. Clear some grass and take a berry. With all that grass, it's very slow moving. Yeah. I think Shard can come across. Oh, look at that. Oh, there's a bunny. bunny. Kill it. Good. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, Shard. <laughs> Took a bath. There we go. And Wonky. Oh, I was like, where'd Piano go? Here he is up here. I don't know if they should have one more baby. Um, maybe they should. Maybe they should wait a day. I know piano's yeah. getting up there in age. Actually, both of them are, huh? Yeah, they're the same age. So they've got five days left. So uh, we'll have them come back together. I can't remember if we were having him go be with somebody else, but I don't think so. Because he's related to Azula, I think, somewhere back there. All right, so we'll have Wonky continue this way, too. Oh, man. She came up behind that mole. Oh, oh Wonky. Oh, she could hit it, but it's not going to do anything. Why don't we have her move away so she doesn't get it? <laughs> Maybe somebody else can kill it. Yeah. Um, all right, Rosie Coral. As aquatic as... Aquatic. <laughs> aquatic. <laughs> as your name sounds. Oh, you can kill them all. Yay, Rosie did it. How much attack does she have? Oof, she has just enough. Mm. All right, so let's have Piano come. He'll pick up our food for us. Where's the other food that was... Oh, oh, it yeah. was with... Okay. And don't destroy it. Will you pick some grass? Okay. So this little group will go that way. Mm -hmm. uh, we have Night Cloud. That's right. Our uh... first midwife. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> Rose. <laughs> I was going to call her a nurse, which is you know, kind of yeah. what she is. But, 
Uh, but we found that we really didn't have anybody unless we want to risk something. Cause she's A, B. She's totally out of the question. Yeah. B. She, she could try with Beluga, who she raised. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Excuse me. Yes. Not to sound insensitive. But does she have any traits that need passing on? Because she might not have given birth to anyone, but she had a fulfilling life. She was needed, she was loved, she was integral to the tribe. So I don't know if it was necessary for her to have a child that she birthed herself. Yeah. And it's a little ironic that she would give birth and then not be able to... Raise her own child. Yeah. Um, yeah, she's got... The spiky body, but she's not the only one who has it recessive. Mm -hmm. um, she's an all-around decent niche link, but you're right. She doesn't really... She's not one of our carriers of recessive bird beak. She does have the tail, but the tail doesn't really do anything for us. And once we find a stump, we can unlock it. Mm. So, um, yeah, that's true. We won't worry about it. Um, I think we're going to risk having it would be better to use somebody else with better yeah. traits. So that's wise, yeah. Um, and less like that. If, if someone comes along and it will 100% be a healthy, happy baby. Um, yeah. But, yeah, I don't know that we need to risk it. Okay. Um, yeah, we won't force anything. We will have Beluga. I guess kill that rabbit. <laughs> <laughs> oh. You're not even strong enough? There. <laughs> <laughs> that poor thing. Uh, okay, spirit. That's right. Spirit's just, she's like, okay, she's gonna hand over fist yes. <laughs> in the grub, looking around, because she's really ready to explore. Mm -hmm. Now, I will say, I, I know, I guess, a lot of us, um, me excluded, um, are, are familiar with all the different lands. That's the first time I've ever seen that patch of grass. Oh, yeah. Is that clover? What is that? I think it's supposed to be, like, swamp, like, oh. lily pad things, because that's the, the swamp grass, um. See this purplish stuff? Yeah. That's the swamp. So those are like cattails. Okay. Um, it's weird that it wouldn't be near the water, but... Yeah, it can kind of just be mixed in, I guess. And that's usually where, like, the poison plants grow. That's also where this tree is from. This tree. Oh, yeah. It, not really a spoiler, but they added a new thing where snails will be on the tree. Snails. Still haven't figured out how you eat them. Oh. I can't remember now. Maybe it's the bird beaks that can get it. That would make sense. fly up to get it. Yeah. But everybody else can't reach them, I guess. Anyway, <laughs> we don't have any snails, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's catch up Night Cloud. Same thing as with her sister. Her genes are okay. She has AH. <laughs> um, so, yes, unless another <laughs> random stranger who is beautiful shows up that's perfect. Um, she may end her life without having an exact child of her own, but she has definitely been the one raising children. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Winnie. <laughs> uh, she's got a lot of running, so why don't we... Looks like you'll be safe over here. Can you actually swim up? Oh, no. Why don't you just pick this up? <laughs> Some torture rabbits. Yeah. Anyway. All right, and then Rose would probably want to keep up with the baby. Rose has three, so if that rabbit wants to come back, that'd be fine. <laughs> uh, Azula's getting older. Mm. Did Azula have any children? I can't remember. Yeah, she had Wimby and Zenith. Ooh. Oh, yeah. that's right. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right, so she's probably doing all right. She's yeah. pretty adventurous, though, so I think she'd try to continue to lead the pack mm -hmm. along. I think that's a good idea. Ooh, she found another berry bush. Beal's been eating all them berries. Yep. And we'll clear a little more grass. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot Zenith. And, um, Kublar. So they should stick together. Um, just keep checking and hoping. Yeah. Um, okay. Oh, she'll have a move. That was so funny. I'm sorry. I heard a little wee. And I was like, what was that? Was that a reveal like a or whatever? Yeah, that's the, it's the door. It's oh, my it studio's a... door. Anyway, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> okay, so that gets our day done. Wow, we're up to 15 nichelings. Takes longer and longer the more nichelings you have. Yeah. 
So, let's just go to the next thing. Yeah. Come on, somebody show up. Mm. Ah. No. I don't what know. What was that noise, though? <sighs> Sound like a purring. What? Yeah. yeah. Maybe it was for Beals moving around? Yeah. I don't know. All right, Belle, you're way back here. <laughs> Go ahead and pick some food. Mm -hmm. Let's have you catch up. That was a reveal. Yeah. Let's see where, though. All righty. <gasps> Zenith is finally a rage. He's like, hey. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we're not even going to pansy around this because this is your last oh. day, Sunflower, but... You can have some good children with him, because right, C H and A B. Yeah. yeah maybe if we could perfect. get like a B C, mm -hmm. ooh, that'd be great. Maybe, maybe she could have twins, but not identical. <laughs> yes, that'd be helpful. Have we had any? Oh, we had that we one, had one set of twins. Yeah. We had one. All right. So let's see what we got for her. Oops, clicked the wrong thing. Let's see. Um, let's first see if she needs anything to fix. Um. She's got webbed feet, but I don't know if we should necessarily say no to that. Because um, we don't know what land we'll be coming to if they'll need to swim. Right. It just slows them down a little bit on land. Oh, okay. Uh, she has big ears. That was helpful. Ooh, she's got the heat body, which we still haven't seen. I wonder if we can yeah. get a heat body baby. Um, but there's no way we can try for that because we haven't unlocked it, right? Right, unless he has it recessive. Nope. But he does a bird. Maybe we'll have a heat bodied bird beak, Ooh. baby. <laughs> we only got one chance. Yeah. Um she's got two kind of unuseful hands. Mm -hmm. So maybe we want to give her some attack. Yeah, I think so. So we can give her this. Especially because Zenith is like Azula's son and like you know that we're getting into the they're the leaders usually, the right. bloodline. He's got the same hand, so let's go ahead and give him some claws too. Um, let's see. We could do something fun, like with pattern or eyes. She yeah. does have these beautiful green eyes below, Ooh. but the black is on top. Yeah. Yeah, maybe the green eyes. Mm -hmm. Just try to help coax that out a bit. And he's got those blue eyes. Mm -hmm. Those are piercing. And orange under here. It doesn't look oh. too orange, but um, he has black horns horns with brown underneath them oh. so if he could bring out black horns that'd be great yeah um, could we um yeah, try to pull that out yeah go ahead and try that okay all right so maybe he'll be the gentleman and ask her yeah that also gives her an extra move yay mm -hmm. okay gotta find a good place for her to have her baby mm -hmm. this is Zula's last day too Aww. Yeah. All right, Azula, you've had a good life. Yeah. I really was hoping. Oh, she could kill something for her last move. So let's get <laughs> Beluga, who loves the berries. <laughs> we can just go ahead and pick some of that. So now Azula, that's Zenith. My sorry, <laughs> Zula. Ooh, kill that too. He's just gonna kill mm. everything. It's good. All right, so she's good last a good move. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Sunflower. Oh, look, a nest. There we go. <laughs> very plentiful. All right, yeah. She, she had a very uh, yeah. active last uh, move. Yeah, she was just kind of hanging around on the periphery of the clan. You know, being yeah. a, a good solid member, but mm -hmm. um, a little bit of... All right, so Zenith. She's going to pick up one of our meats. A little Wimmy who can run like a wind. The wind. <laughs> Wimmy could be uh, one of our new um, midwives. Oh, yeah. She's very sweet. Mm -hmm. so she's here for the birth. And we will get... Oh, this is a rose's last day. We never oh. did find anybody. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, I just don't... Like you said, it's not... Yeah. On this particular time, not worth it. Um. But let's have her come up so she can also be here to help with the baby. Because she did like to take care of the children. Yeah. Oh, so that's a cute little group up there. They got plenty mm -hmm. of food. Yes. <laughs> um, okay, so we'll have these two 
beluga. No more berries, so he doesn't know what to do with himself. There's berries on that bush, but... <laughs> yeah. Secret over there. Ooh, there's a mole. Mm. I really bet a uh, spirit would like to kill oh, that, yes. so... Let's not scare it. Leave it there for a second. Let's have... Nightcloud will go this way to help with babies on this side. Yeah. A lot of berries. All right, let's check them all. One more. Ooh, I should have a nap. Hmm. There we go, spirit. Murder. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And we'll have Beluga catch up with you. Is Beluga hit her dad? No, Zenith's dad. Eh, the body's like the same, the head just straight <laughs> Okay, Beluga had Zenith and Whimsy. Mm -hmm. I mean, Whimmy. Okay. And spirit. Whoa, no. Go ahead and pick up the meat. Oh, and then the bunny comes out. Uh, She'll winner. get you next time. You. <laughs> oh, little bell got left. Mm -hmm. Where do you think she'd want to go? She want to go um, this way or? Maybe. I mean, which, which way can she see better? Kind of this way. She can still yeah. see them hanging out over here. I think she'd probably go that way. Okay. Unless, them. is there a potential mate the other way? Oh, now it's too late for her. B A B H. Maybe. Okay. Yeah. That's a problem we're running into. Yeah. That's her dad, so no. Uh, shard is F A B A. H F A also. It's probably yeah. How many attack do you have, Tonky? Two. Okay, kill that rabbit. <laughs> <laughs> we're getting lots of food though. That's yeah, great. that's great. So why don't we have little Shard be a little adventurous? Well, look at all the wolves. Mm. The spirit should have gone that way. Yeah, that's true. She might hear that. Uh, wait a minute, what? <laughs> Moles. Just for my move. All right, so we'll just adventure in. Mm -hmm. I thought, why don't you pick that up? Let's remember to clear some grass so we can all move better. All right, so Piano and Wonky might want to have another baby, so I'll keep him nearby. Another bunny. These bunnies are just like handing themselves mm -hmm. to us. I, with all the They're food fearless, we're getting, but... you'd think we'd be attracting somebody. Yeah. Alright, Rosy Coral, you're still young, so... Get some rest. Alright, that's everybody. Doing really well on food and uh, nesting material. Mm -hmm. Um, weird to see them so stretched out like that, but all right, so yeah. let's go to the next day and see what baby we get and say goodbye yeah. to these two up here. So, bittersweet. Yeah, our first, uh, lovely midwife, Rose, uh, she did a great job. Remember when she was born with a little surprise yeah. of pink? Mm -hmm. uh, it's a little sad she's not with her sister for her last moments, but I think that they, yeah. they knew, yeah. you know, it's going to happen. So, and then of course, Sunflower who, with her last breath, will plant the seed for the <laughs> blossoming. We'll have to find a, yes. another um, flower-based name for, mm -hmm. for the baby. And so we've got our little in-training Wimmy. Mm, yeah, that's so adorable. she will pass on. The She'll be a full adult tomorrow, too. Oh she, oh, she might be. I don't know how it works. Oh, I was thinking the three dots. Sorry. Three moves. But, oh, yeah. But I guess that's not adult. She'll be a teenager. <laughs> She'll be old enough to help. Yes. All right. Fingers crossed for a good gene match here with her dad right here. Is this Azula's last day too? You're right. Mm -hmm. Azula. There's a lot of skeletons yeah. in that corner. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Morbid, the but... baby's going to like, I'm alive. What's this? <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. Azula was a very good co-leader. Yeah. Um. Leaving, so she's got some good children life left behind mm -hmm. her. She's you know, Zenith and um, Wimmy. Wimmy. So actually, both of her children are near her. Yeah. The spirit was uh, Terra's last day. Okay. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> yeah. Well, they all three had a very good life. Yeah. I'm sorry to see them all go at the same time. It's really hard to lose one of you know. I don't want to. I don't think we we're losing anybody else. Check real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Okay. 
So we still got some time. It's just everybody up here. All right. We love you guys. Mm. Thank you for... Not you. <laughs> well, we love you. But yes. <laughs> thank you very much for your contributions to the tribe. Mm -hmm. Bring us to a nice peaceful land. Yeah. Oh. Ooh, scary dad. <laughs> and a baby. <sighs> Sounds like a very morbid play. Oh, yeah. Three deaths and a baby. We got a little rare or rare. Oh. Six attack. Whoa. Green eyes. Still Looks a lot like beak. spirit. Yeah. Big oh, yeah, ears. She does, doesn't she? She's spirit without the uh... dirt face. <laughs> got the green eyes we wanted. Mm -hmm. She didn't carry forward heat body, unfortunately. Uh. Uh, but she does have bird beak. Recessive. One day we'll coax that out. Yeah. Um, very strong. Mm hmm. Uh, she's got web hind legs recessive. She's got the red and black for us where she gets that nice deep red. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's go find her a name and we shall be right back. Okay. And we have a name for this secondary killer, maybe co leader coming mm -hmm. up. Very important. We shall name her Nightshade. Nightshade. Which is a, a deadly plant. It is. And uh, so she, yeah, she's very strong. I think leading up to her birth, we were thinking that she would probably be a good contender for a leader. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, yeah. But then she also follows her mother's naming of, uh, of a plant. Of a plant, yeah. Um, all right. So she does have the bee still here, which is a little bit disappointing. Um... Shard has FA. So Shard could come back over that way to be mm. her mate eventually. The rest of these are older men. Um, uh, you know what piano lasts? I don't even know. Oh, okay. Beluga's BH. So Sue's CB. Oh, AH would. Piano would technically. That's true. I don't think he's related to her, is he? I don't. No, I don't think so. Um, Piano dead. is a very is uh was Winter Bear who was um, Sassanola's. Oh, that's true. You know, so there there's that line and lineage. I don't know if he'll live long enough. That's yeah, probably. he's only got three days, and she needs like five, I think, is when okay. they're coming. Yeah. But um, Shard is a good... Uh... Yeah, so we'll keep him in mind. Mm -hmm. Drop that down. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, well, I kind of hate leaving things like this. Do we want to finish the day? Yeah. Um, okay, so. Got a new little baby and what? a newly born... <laughs> 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 newly crowned... Um, caretaker here. Mm -hmm. Midwife. You keep forgetting that name. I don't know why. I feel my brain <laughs> trying. So she will take care of the baby. But of course Zenith will be nearby to protect them both. It's funny. We're also kind of keeping in line with the color scheme because Wimmy's uh, gray and she's oh, the midwife. Yeah. <laughs> I don't mm -hmm. think we thought of that necessarily but it was. it's interesting. Yeah. Maybe there's something calming about the gray. You know, it's nice and soft. Yeah, I definitely think so. Um, all right, so here comes Beluga. He's about to break through. Looking for them berries. <laughs> <laughs> and we know it's that... good thing we oh. didn't name a her berry or whatever. <laughs> Uh-oh, yeah. He can get confused. Okay, so Spirit can kill that mole in the next turn. Yeah, there's lots of moles. Hmm. Everywhere. Yeah, there's a lot of food on this island. Mm-hmm. Got some moles up in here. <laughs> Um, all right, Wonky and Piano could have another baby. Yeah. Uh, we'll give them another day. They're probably enjoying their freedom. Yes. <laughs> uh, so there is a mole over here we can kill. Is he in that one? Yeah. So maybe White Dot? Yeah, White Dot can get that one. So we'll have this pair go up this way. Okay, White Dot. We'll just step up here and murder a small animal. <laughs> I'm sorry, hunt. Hunt yes. a small animal. Murder. <laughs> Alright, let's not forget to keep the way clear. Man, we're just running into a whole bunch of nothing over here. That is really weird. 
I, I'm very surprised, but uh, Tonky will also hunt. Look at that rabbit over there eating our berries. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's have Shard come back around. Okay, you just stay next to an adult. Yeah, we might just want them to go back over that way. Um, Rosy Coral. Come up this way. There we go. She found a nut tree. We haven't mm -hmm. eaten nuts in a while. Yeah. That's good. All right. Well, now the way's closed off, so they're like, er. <laughs> uh, Night Cloud should probably try to come through so that she can be. <laughs> <laughs> she can be the midwife again for yeah. um, Tonky. Tonky. So she'll go ahead and get the nest ready. Wonky. Oh, excuse me. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. She'll get the nest ready so that next time we can yeah. have the baby and she'll be there for the last birth on that side. All right, and then Spirit, I was not paying attention. I think you can get... Uh, you might scare it. Why don't you... She's going to hate me, but why don't you come up and get this meat? Because you don't have any cracking. I just feel like if I step here, we're going to scare them all. Right. So... Another mole down that way too. I just come over here and pick this meat up. You can go one round without killing somebody. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so we're leaving them in a very good place. Look how definitely separated they all are. Mm -hmm. But I'm sure they know how. They have some ways of keeping in touch with each other. Yeah. Um, they'll get temporarily excited, be like, oh, "Is that another niche thing?" And then, "Oh man, you're part oh. of my tribe already." <laughs> <laughs> Give them a good sniff and be like, "Nope." Yeah. <laughs> we're somehow bound together. <laughs> well. This little paw print island is not giving us any other nichelings. No. I guess it's a sign that, you know, we, we should collect more food, maybe have a couple more babies, but then, I mean, that, that um, next island land is pretty small. How many, like, five or six? Yeah. I guess you can stand in the uh, grass. I don't think these count. So, guessing it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Yeah, 10 seems like, it's usually like 5, 10, or 15, I think. Oh, okay. I don't think that they go in like 12s and 11s That's that good. I've noticed. Yeah. So. Well, then, yeah, I mean, we have a few, um, well, I guess we're quote-unquote trading out because we do have a few ones that will not make it, like Night Cloud and Piano, and yeah. actually probably Tonky and Wonky won't. I don't yeah. know. They do have some time, but. Um, so, yeah, or, so I guess yeah. everyone can come with us um, if we just wait them out a little. Yeah, um. Don't know if it's beneficial. We'll need to send as many as we can. Yeah. Um, just because we've got very weird genes going on. Definitely. Really wish we could find... I know we'd find lots of wanderers if we could get to the whale. So mm. maybe Beluga can help us. Yeah. Um, maybe he can bring us to the land that'll then bring us to the whale. Because we don't have a whale port here. But since right. Beluga... Um, mother Came from the sea. Him, yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> maybe he can bring us back. Um, cause that would be fun. Yeah. Um, and you know, maybe on a harder island we'll have some, uh, we've also not seen what we know as a rogue. True. So, not in a while. Um, all right. Thank you guys again for joining us. Welcome to all the new people coming in and, uh, we're always open to name suggestions. Thank you very much. Last time from Mothy that flew amongst the storm of stars. Mm, that's beautiful. <laughs> yeah. I would name a nicheling that, you know, me from my other one. Um, but thank you for the name list. We did mm -hmm. add all those new names. We're always accepting names, guys. So if you have any um, that you'd like. We also really appreciate challenges. We've not been able to mm -hmm. get the one we have. Uh, Damien, red right. with black horns. But if you have another one, maybe you had a favorite niche thing in one of your games or another game that you saw that you really wanted to see us try to aim for. Mm -hmm. um, trying to unlock some things. Yeah. <laughs> we don't have much unlocked yet, but we'll keep trying. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys for joining us. I hope you have a very merry, happy, happy New Year. Mm -hmm. We have a merry New Year too, but yeah, it's... people usually don't say that, but no. you could have yeah. one <laughs> joyous, uh... joyous New Year. <laughs> uh, have safe parties mm -hmm. and hope you have fun, and we'll see you the next time. Stay crazy.